Now, there's a new twist to the drama going on between Senator Dina Malaye and the Nigerian police. As police authorities on Monday declared the senator hail, hurdy, and fit to stand trial, the senator is facing fresh charges of culpable homicide in relation to the shooting of a police officer. Assistant Inspector General of Police, Takaomi Amadu, who is a medical doctor at the Garki Police Hospital, said test results shows everything is fine with the lawmaker. Police spokesman Jim Mashud, who visited the police hospital in Garki, also says the police is doing everything to ensure the senator gets the best medical care so that he can stand trial. Do you remember when he was rushed here, he had an acute asthmatic attack? He was brought in from the SARS facility. And we managed his acute asthmatic attack. He came out of asthma. And then since then, we had an incidental finding of malaria and typhoid fever. Along the way, he raised complaints of some symptoms suggestive of some nerve fractures. We took him to a specialist center where he was reviewed by three specialists. But he is in good health now. At every moment, if there is any cause for us to invite a specialist or take him to a specialist center, we oblige him. At this moment, his blood, uh, his uh, pulse rate this morning is 82 per minute, which is normal. His blood pressure this morning is 120, 90 milliliters of mercury. Remember, he's a non-hypertensive and asthmatic. For a non-hypertensive to have a sustained blood pressure of 120, 90 milliliters of mercury is an indication of good management of the hypertension. He also has a respiratory rate of 20 per minute. So, by and large, he's in sound health. We are happy that we are giving him an excellent management. I want to re-emphasize that the Nigerian police will prosecute him definitely uh, with other members of his gang that were responsible for the shooting of uh, a police sergeant, that's the Sergeant Daji Masali uh, in Kogi State, Lokoja, uh, sorry, in, uh, in Kogi State on the 19th of July, 2018. Uh, we are not going to retreat, we will ensure that we get this matter to logical conclusion and to equally serve a deterrent to who will be offender because the fact still remains that uh, no matter how highly placed an individual is, if you are involved in a criminal matter, we will definitely prosecute you and ensure that the law take its course.